Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, it's Quinn. I know I've been gone lately, but um, it's finally summer break, and um, I can finally do more reviews and stuff. And it's like 1.30, so might as well get this done. Um, so today's movie I'll be reviewing is the Karate Kid remake, and um, I've seen all I've seen all of the Karate Kids. I'm a big fan of them. I love the mo I love the franchise. Um, and this one, I I think it's like for the people like uh, they put it in there the way they kind of did it. I think they pulled it off really well. Like um, Jaden Smith, um, his acting is wonderful. I mean. He puts so much emotion into it. I, I had really low, like, expectations, because, I mean, remakes aren't that good. And this is, like, a classic, great movie. I didn't want to be ruined. And they made it awesome, and I love everything about it. Um, so, uh, there's... So, basically, what it's about is, uh, this kid, um, Dre, uh, his mom has to move to uh, Beijing, so he has to go with her. And basically, he doesn't like it there that much. And um, he basically gets there, and he gets uh, beaten up by some kids. And he and he gets like in he gets beat up like twice or something like that. And the and it's kind of like the same. It's kind of like that one part in the original where. Uh, he in the original uh karate kid where he gets, he's getting beat up and then he jumps over the fence uh Miyagi I think his name is jumps over the fence and uh and attacks him and like gets him out of there and that's basically what happened those kind of early in the movie and um he basically heals him instead of the Miyagi magic thing um he does the thing with the cups with the he does this thing where he puts this fire cotton ball thing in the cup and then spreads it across the scene, so it's not this thing anymore, it's like a cup thing, I don't know, but, um, I mean, it, it was, it was a pretty good remake for what, for remake, uh, remakes, I, I think it was actually did pretty well, I mean, um, there's like some things where I kept on making comments, because I watched it twice, I think, I watched it when it originally came out, and, uh, then I watched it again a couple, like, a week ago or something like that. And, um, well, a couple weeks ago. Yeah. And, um, and we kept on saying, well, and they're like, I was like, oh, that could have been easily done. Maybe if he did, uh, maybe if he knew how to wax on, wax off, because he didn't have any of that. Instead of the, oops, instead of the wax on, wax off, he did, um, he, he does this thing where he takes off the jacket and puts it on this thing and then takes it down, puts it on the ground. And it was, kind of, and it, it was like close to wax on, wax off, but it, it felt like that, but yeah, it had Jackie Chan and it had Jane Smith, those are some actors that if you put them in a movie, usually the movie comes out pretty good, so, uh, out of everything, I give it about a 7 out of 10, because, uh, I mean, it, I can't really give remake, remakes that good of a, review because I don't like remakes like unless it's like a really bad like the Tron remake was needed because the original Tron I didn't like that much like to be honest it was like I couldn't follow the original Tron but once they made it I really only saw the remake of Tron because it had Daft Punk in it and that's like my favorite band so uh yeah so uh thanks for watching uh check out my links below I'll see you guys later peace